Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 35, and this is war number eight. And we're going up against an alliance called Italia, Marvel Zarboris. And let's take a look, who do they ban? All right, they ban Hercules, Quake, and Human Torch. All right. And let's go ahead and spectate, see what we got going on. Uh, I take path three, sections one and two. Oh, my. No one on that uh, second node there, but someone on the first one. That's that's odd. Usually I see the reverse. You know, no one on that first node where Sentinel is and then someone on the uh, second node. But OK. Um, hmm. That would be interesting. They didn't ban Corvus. They did put a man thing there. But we have a plan for Man Thing. We're gonna double team him, uh, so I don't have to worry about that. I don't usually worry about the middle. Okay, so we've got Apocalypse and Nimrod. Hmm. Okay, so chances are I won't be awake for Apocalypse. They will be ready so probably I need to take that Nimrod up there um, I don't worry about Colossus that's um, Claire all day Let's see here yep unstoppable armor all right so we got Claire uh, she can handle both of these fights and now I was told that uh, for Nimrod uh, Nebula might be a good shot. I hate playing with Nebula, though. I really do. But um, that might be the play. Let's see. Yeah, I might bring... Let's see. Buffet. Hmm. I mean, I know she can do that fight. How can I do that fight with her is the question. Uh, let's see. And of course, we know Warlock, but I have uh, just so much variance when I bring Warlock for Nimrod. I've done the fight, and then sometimes something will happen, and I'll mess up. Um, but it does seem like Nebula is great uh, to handle that Nimrod. So I, I might give her another try. I might give her another try. Um, yeah, all right. Uh, let's go. And uh, if she does well, maybe I'll take her up. Um, we'll see. We'll see. All right. Let's get on with the fighting. All right, so I'm going in here with Claire. We're also going in with White Magneto. He's there only for his pre-fight. And we're going in with Nebula. I believe this is the first war that I am bringing my rank three. I just took her up um, before this war uh, into war. And let me tell you, she rocks. When you have her in the proper matchup, which that man thing on that node, I don't like her for that uh, fight. I've seen it done, and I could see how it would work, but I'll leave that to somebody else because I don't like I don't like doing that. All right, so first fight is going to be against uh, El Sentinel, and Claire, she's going to rip him apart. Uh, I do a medium light medium so that I can keep the analysis charges down and build up to a special uh, two. And I have that power gain because he's immune uh, to my bleed. And I did evade there. It's a little risky, but I'm just used to doing it. All right, so here we go. I didn't want to do a special three, so I fired off my special two. And as you can see, my health is looking good. And his health is not looking good. Look at that. 
already to a special two again and done i do love claire she is just so good i may take her to rank four if i get the opportunity we'll we'll see we'll see how it goes all right so we didn't have anybody on this node now i went up to you know put my pre-fights on and we actually discussed this fight and a way to do it. And I believe this was the first time we were trying it. So my alliance mate brought in his thing. Uh, my thing was only rank two. He has a rank three thing. But if you see, it didn't go so well. And I was concerned because the SIG level of his thing was the same as mine. It, it, we weren't SIG 200 and without being sig 200 i worried that it was not going to go as well as uh we saw in some of the uh videos and he was like yeah he didn't like uh, using thing he found thing to be a little bit slower than he liked and all of that so he asked me to uh go in and uh finish up so claire can do this fight especially if it's just clearing it up but I wouldn't want to try to use her for the entire fight. Uh, I've tried it before, and it's sort of hit or miss. You know? Now, it's kind of disconcerting when you fire off your special two like that, and you look, and his health is just not moving. You're like, okay. You know, you can stay in poison, but you've got other things you got to deal with. But... As long as he was almost dead, we can finish him off. So not a big deal. All right. So uh, we had already discussed a uh, plan and who was going to take what mini boss. Uh, I finished that mini boss off and I forget which one uh, was going to take that uh, middle mini boss to open up uh, section two. Uh, right there, you can see I moved up there to use my energy. Um, and, and one of them, I, I don't remember which one. But if you look up there, do you see that Nimrod? And you may notice that my alliance mate is knocked out. And that Nimrod looks chewed on a little bit. Now, I brought in Nebula for that Nimrod. Now, at this point in time, I have not fought nimrod yet on that node with nebula i I've, I've only heard how good she was for it i could see where she would be good for it but this was the first war video like i said earlier after i took her to rank three now if you watched my mystery rank up theater where i did take up uh, nebula you will have seen this fight and one other well actually no you wouldn't see this fight you see a fight that i had to do later i was gonna use this fight but as you saw it wasn't a full health nimrod and i kind of wanted to uh use a full health nimrod so you could see her from beginning to end all right so once again we have colossus here you guys have seen it before it's it's a simple, straightforward fight for Claire. Um, not, not, uh, nothing really tricky about it at all. Um, I think, what was the next one? Was it a guillotine? No. Another uh, annoying. Now, Mr. Bobblehead here uh, can be very, very annoying. And I was tempted to use uh, Nebula on him. But I was like, nah, not going to do that. Um, I thought about doing this as well, but there was no reason to. And I may take up uh, Magneto uh, to rank two, but for right now, he was only in there for his pre-fight. And his pre-fight is worth using up a slot. It makes that first mini much easier. All right, so the reason that I like to use Claire here is that there's also explosive personality on this node. And if I do hit him, which I'm going to hit him into his block because he has that auto block, she's going to nullify 
the um, armor ups. So I'll never have to worry about him going unstoppable on me because um, he'll never be able to get that many armor ups. Other than that, I just have to try to play it a little slow. This is risky. I had to try to time it so that it would finish before his auto block came because if his auto block pops up in the middle of my special, he'll just auto block it and block the rest of the special and then retaliate and whoop my butt. Okay, so not a good time. Not a good time when that happened. So that was a little risky, but I wanted to be done uh, with that fight. The longer fights uh, go on, the more likely you are to uh, mess up. All right, so now we are going to be facing Nimrod on this node, and you'll get a little preview, all right? So this Nimrod is a rank three. And I, let me tell you, uh, I was listening, and, and I'm glad I did, to my alliance mates because if you guys remember i often used warlock to fight this nimrod and it was hit or miss you know sometimes i would get him and i could beat him with nimrod uh, with a uh, warlock but then sometimes some shenanigan would happen and next thing i know i'm eating a special too but this is this is i got caught by the special but self-repair put me right on back up Pretty, pretty good. All right. So then I was like, okay, I see how you want to play. All right. Now, he's not full health. But let me tell you, it's not going to matter. And if you saw the video, you know it doesn't matter. I faced a rank four uh, Nimrod on this node. Didn't matter. See, there we go. Shock. Boom. Fight's over. And that will work even against a rank four Nimrod. Uh, so, yeah, Nebula is definitely my favorite for taking on this node, especially if it's a Nimrod. Um, and, and as long as they're not shock immune, uh, she's going to really rip them. All right. So as you can see, they already finished off uh, boss mini boss island and they cleared off the boss. All right. So in a minute, we'll be back and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we have another win. We are on a winning streak right now. Uh, we have changed up our strategy and we are doing much, much better in Alliance War. Uh, but that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. What do you think about Nebula? She is crazy good. She's also good for node 24. That's that middle node. Uh, that opens up section two. You'll see me in a future war using her on that note as well. All right, so take care and you all have a blessed day.